First, I do want to start off by thanking the amazing village organizations. I can attest that from my day one in this campaign that they have made things happen for me. So I'd like to give them another round of applause, please. Half a day, everyone. My name is Amanda Francel Blas, Familian Daru and Bucci, and I am your youngest senatorial candidate this year. Driving down south is one of my favorite memories of living on Guam. And that's because you enjoy the beauty of the island. You enjoy the ocean. You enjoy the greenery. It's just beautiful. And I've been to several places in the world, but nothing does compare to the southern part of Guam. And I bring this up. And I bring this up because it reminds me when I was off island pursuing my bachelor's degree at the University of Portland. It reminds me how much I missed it, how much I missed driving down south, enjoying the view, enjoying the waters. It reminded me how mahaling I'd get for my family, for the hospitality, and everything that makes Guam great. And while I'm blessed now to enjoy it every day, it does remind me of the hundreds of people of Guam who are far away from our island home pursuing opportunities they no longer believe are here on our island. And I think it's time to change that. I think it's time to change and to ensure that the people of Guam and the next generations have the opportunities, have amazing opportunities, starting with our island's thriving industry and biggest industry, tourism. And that is why when I am elected, my first bill will work towards the creation of the island and the region's first hospitality charter school. The reason why I want to do this is because there is an amazing tourism industry. We just celebrated the best fiscal year in our tourism history to date. And I think we're well on our way to having more amazing years for tourism. And I think it's time that our people, the next generation, and the generations after that have the opportunity to take advantage of the careers and the jobs that the hospitality and tourism industry has to offer. Now I think limiting ourselves to one industry isn't the best for our island. While I love our tourism industry, I think it's time to pursue other industries that will help us as well. I think it's time to look at agriculture as an industry. My grandfather, he used to always talk to me about how he would go to the Martinez farm and the Artero farm and he would cut livestock. He would talk about how his grandmother, his mother would plant amazing crops that they'd use in their kitchen. And I think it's time to go back to embracing the talents of our people and let's start and help thrive the agriculture industry on Guam. My grandma also taught me some things as well. She's from Petey, and she grew up living near a waterfall, and she would talk about the shrimp and the lobster she'd find at the end of the waterfall. And that made me think, why are we not embracing an aquaculture industry? Why are we not embracing the talents of our fishermen? It's time for us to do this. It's time for us to embrace two new industries and promote our thriving one. And with that being said, once again, my name is Amanda Francel Blas, and I humbly ask for your vote as number 15 on the Republican side. So please remember, start by voting from the bottom up. <laughs>